and the India's G20 Presidency, Indian Space Research Organization of the Department of Space, is organizing the precursor event of the fourth edition of Space Economy Leaders Meeting with active support from Government of Meghalaya and India's Ministry of External Affairs on the 17th and 18th of April 2023 at Hotel Courtyard Marriott in Shillong. Ambassadors, High Commissioners and senior diplomats of G20 and invited countries are participating in this event. Good afternoon, our friends. Uh, just to sort of introduce you all to the Space uh, Economy Leaders Meeting, which is part of the G20 uh, Gen Bhagidari thing happening across the country. We are fortunate that Shillong has been selected as a uh, venue for a, such a major event, wherein we expect about uh, 28 diplomats from various countries and uh, more than 100 uh, to delegates also participating, including technocrats. Uh, it would be a rare occasion and opportunity for the state to showcase our own unique culture, our uh, natural beauty, our own cuisine, and uh, uh, most uh, sought after cleanliness, hygiene, and hospitality. And getting such a high level delegates to come to our state it's a rare occasion, so we should uh, not only from the government side, from the entire community and citizenry should present the best uh, foot forward uh, so that they go back with good memories, phone memories, and that will hel help in showcasing and benchmarking and positioning Meghalaya as a prime destination of tourism, investment and development. We would have... Uh, about uh, 28 startups uh, in the space economy sector participating in the event. And we would also have exhibits by the side of the conference, which is going to be held in Marriott, you all are aware. Uh, apart from the ISRO, Government of India Agency, there would be exhibitions, exhibits by the startups also in the space economy industry. We would also showcase our own cultural heritage. There will be cultural events and also stalls from the side of Meghalaya. Uh, I would uh, urge uh, the friends from the media also to really reflect the positive aspect of Meghalaya so that the delegates during their visit also see about whatever the vibrancy of our society, goodness of our community and all our community-based development which we have done so far, which has really positioned us one of the topmost country in community-based preservation, protection of nature and conservation. Uh, with this, if you have a specific thing on the uh, uh, technical aspect of the uh, G20, I would uh, welcome that. Otherwise, this is a part of the G20 presidency is given to India from 2022. You're all aware of that. It is on circulation, rotation. So this is once in a 20-year opportunity for India to showcase ourselves. So this across the sector, one good thing which we happened is we are sort of celebrating it as a Jan Bhagidari. The entire G20 is taken to a level of people's participation. So instead of doing it in one city, it is done in every city, most of the cities and most of the capitals. So that is where, uh, even for this event, there's something called econom economy, uh, responsibility and alliance creation. So in a sector like space economy, you need alliances because it's a technology is something which is naive and at a different level. If the countries can't participate and share, it can't really get into the fruitful end. So in the, with this uh, in mind, the earlier G20 uh, countries like Kind Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, Italy and Indonesia has also since 2020 has done these kind of events for collaboration. So this is a sort of continuity for that which we are doing uh, in uh, Shillong. Uh, the theme of the G20 is one earth, one space and one future, which is part of our national ethos, Vasudeva Kudumbagam. So this is where we pitch in and we would like to have a positive alliance and collaboration across the globe for a better future for the mankind. Thank you very much.